Hello, what is up? I'm gonna show you how to make some awesome vocal chops. But yeah, just a quick tutorial, nothing too crazy or complicated, but I'll show you the vocal chops right now. This is how they sound. Those are vocal chops that I made, and here is how I got to that point. So you see these two tracks. So this is the actual track. Uh, sorry about that. This is the actual track. And then, so what I did was I took this track and duplicate it. Uh, the reason why you duplicate it is because if you turn this into a sampler track, the, your original track, it's going to just, I've never really figured out how to, uh, reactivate it like this so I just kind of create a duplicate track and then copy it over uh, let me just show you just kind of go like this duplicate it copy over just so you can mess with it uh, let me just go back here uh, now it's gonna take a while but yeah anyways if you watch the little loading button uh, basically what you want to do is you want to go in and you want to cut where all the oohs and the ahs are. You don't want any T's or sh's or ch's. You just want to go in and cut all at all of those points on your track. And then once you do, which hopefully I'll show you in a minute, uh, will work. Okay, so there we go. Uh, let me just delete this track. And so yeah, you go in. And you basically just, all the oohs and ahs, see look like right here. See look right here. Wait, I'll try to get it. See, it, uh, it didn't get any of the S's or any of the other things. So this would be a good place to cut it too, which is where I cut it. And then, so you do that with everything on your track. And if you're more practical or uh, whether or not uh, like and you want to play it like on your keyboard, uh, once you've done that, you're going to select everything that you want and then you're going to go to convert and then convert to new sampler track. And that's going to put your all of your, I guess, vocal samples onto a MIDI track. So now... Once you do that, you're going to get this, which is, and basically you're going to be able to just play it on your MIDI, on your keyboard, and just mess around with it. See? So yeah, that's basically, that's basically it. That's basically how I did it. And I kind of just went until I messed around with the whole, like, until I found something that I liked. And yeah, that's basically how I did it. I hope you found this helpful. And yeah, I'll just give you a quick listen of how everything sounds together. This is how the whole song sounds. But yeah, that's it. Hope you liked it and peace.